the video, I mean, we can learn something and some point that you already made, mm -hmm. that is one of the, our rights upon our neighbor is not harming them. Mm -hmm. It is important because and the Prophet ever said, Man kana yu'minu billahi wal yawmil akhir fala yu'di jarahu. Whoever believes in Allah and, and believes in the last day, he should not harm his neighbor. So I think it is the important message of Islamic religion that we as Muslim we should not harm our neighbors. Mm. And also <coughs> maybe not harming our neighbors is very easy, but if we are being harmed, it is easy for us to forgive them. Of course, it is more difficult. Right. Yes. That is why one of the tabi'in, the follower of companion of Prophet Muhammad so by, nan, by the name of Hassan al-Basri, he is very famous uh, tabi'in. He ever said, Laysa husnul jiwar al kafu anil ada. Being good neighbor is not that you don't harm your neighbor, but husnul jiwar huwa asabru al al ada. But being good neighbor is that when you can be patient, whenever your neighbor is harming you. Mm -hmm. It is very important. Mm -hmm. And there is story when in the time of Hassan al-Basri, Hassan al-Basri was living sort of like apartment. And his neighbor who, who is living above him in the toilet, there is something liquid that drop on in the house of Hassan al-Basri. Mm -hmm. Hassan as Bas Basri ha just take the, the, the container in order to collect, collect the liquid. Mm, mm -hmm. Someday Hassan, as Hassan al Basri was getting sick and this neighbor was feasting him. When he was feasting him, he knew this container that Hassan al Basri used to, to collect liquid that is dropping from, yeah, from his neighbors. Uh, yes. Uh -huh. And this neighbor was asking to Hassan, as, uh, Hassan al Basri, how many days, how many months did you do that? Yeah. Hassan al Basri s replied by saying, I did it 20 years. <laughs> <laughs> so long time. He was yeah. very patient. Mm -hmm. 